What's up everybody? Today is a little spicy yoga flow. Super short, super quick, just to get you fired up. You know, the solar plexus activated. Uh, I just got out of an ice bath like 40 minutes ago and it's one of those days where I am still shaking off a cold chill. So, this is for you and me. With that being said, we're gonna hop right into down dog. So, lift those hips up. Send them back and just start pedaling at the feet. Widen out those fingers and just settle in here. We're gonna act pretty primal today. We're gonna get right into it. So if you do need to do a little bit of warm up, you can pause this video for 30 seconds, roll out your joints, but I think you're good. We'll go, we'll go at a slow, steady pace upward. So with that being said, let's start to walk the feet to the hands. Oh, we're feeling good. And maybe ragdoll it out here. Maybe shake it out, sway left and right. Shake the head, yes and no. Wonderful. Hands back to the ground, walking the feet to back to down dog. Shake it out one more time. Make sure your head is nice and loose. Your neck, you don't hold any tension. Maybe shake that, shake that booty a little bit. Get the hips, side body opened up. Wonderful. All right, from here, inhale. Let's reach the right foot up. As you exhale, step this foot down by the right thumb. Drop the left knee. Inhale, bring it on up. Reach the hands high. And we're going to exhale. Switch to the right. Inhale, come back up to the front. Exhale, twist to the right. Let's do one more. Inhale, back up. Exhale, twist. Let's pause here. Gaze back at the right thumb and just breathe. So right here, first static pose, we're hopping right into it. This is hopping right into it. <laughs> I want you to see how your breath is doing and how your breath is doing as it enters through the stomach. Are you breathing just through the upper chest when you're in any sort of compression or are you still breathing through the lower body too? Nice and even. Pulling in at that Uddiyana Bandha, that lower stomach area, but still breathing through the stomach and chest. Awesome, on the next inhale, let's reach this left hand to the sky. Maybe right hand comes to the back of the left leg. And now we're opening up, so different sensation here. Breathing, can you feel that breath coming through the stomach? Not losing your integrity of the pose, but not losing the integrity of your breath to get a pose. That's the main thing, right? So one more inhale, keep breathing that left hand high. Awesome, exhale, left hand comes to the ground. Let's step this right foot back to meet the left foot into side plank. So right here, I want you to engage right here in the middle of the stomach, middle of the core. You could engage the lower obliques in this pose, but I want you to twist a little bit. Twist your chest upward to the sky just a little bit to engage a little bit higher. I want you to be in that solar plexus region. So with that being said, maybe you stay here or you lift the right foot, right hand up. Stay here or exhale, squeeze, elbow to knee. Inhale, reach it long. Exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, long. Awesome, exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, reach it back out. This time, exhale, step this right foot to the top of the mat. Drop the left knee back down. Inhale, reach both hands up. Exhale, hands wrap that right foot. Spine of Chaturanga. Inhale, press it up, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left foot up. Same thing, left side. Exhale, step it down by the left thumb. Drop the right knee. Inhale, come on up, lunge pose. Exhale, we're gonna to twist to the left. Inhale, come on up. Exhale, twist to the left. Inhale. Exhale, we twist. And this time we stay here. So again, check in on your breathing. How do you feel? We're warming up. I'm already feeling warmer from the ice bath. <laughs> Promise you that. But we're breathing. We're getting long to the spine. We're active in the legs, of course. But we're not compromising our breath. We're breathing fully. On the next inhale, reaching the right hand up, left hand behind the leg, 
Maybe you sank a little bit deeper into the hips if that's okay. We're reaching this right hand up and away from this right hip, opening up the right side body, the stomach right here. One more big inhale. And as you exhale, right hand comes to the ground. Step that left foot back to meet the right. And again, we're engaging the higher obliques here. Maybe inhale, lift the foot and hand up, reach long. You can stay here or exhale, elbow knee. Inhale, open up. Exhale, squeeze it in. Inhale, one more. Exhale. Inhale, wonderful. Exhale, step the left foot to the top of the mat. Good balance. Drop the right knee, inhale, scoop it up, lunge pose, reach high. Exhale, hands wrap the left foot, find your chaturanga. Inhaling up dog. Exhale, child pose. And child pose, let's rock left and right. Just two breaths here. While you're here, I want you to figure inhale. Feel yourself balloon your stomach up as much as you can. And on the exhales, really push it all out. One more of those. And when you inhale, I want you to open up the stomach, really trying to bleed, breathe into the like, kind of upper stomach region, right here. And again, exhale, you might give a little push. One more, I'll do it with you. Inhale. Feel your stomach against the inner thighs. Exhale. Beautiful. Keep that going as we inhale. Scoop it forward into cobra. Bend the elbows, pull the chest forward. Big breath into the stomach. And then exhale, send it back, child pose. Pull in at the lower stomach. Inhale, scoop it forward. Cobra pose. Exhale, child pose. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. I know it's hard to breathe, especially when you're open up like this, but breathing through the stomach. Exhale. Last one. In. Open up. Exhale. Wonderful. Curl on the toes. Lift the hips back up into down dog. With our left hand, we're gonna reach through, grab the right ankle, gaze under the right armpit, get along through this right hand, still sending the hips up just like any other down dog, pulling us through a little bit, feeling the twist at the lower back, right where we wanna breathe. So in this one, I got a fun breath for you. Again, we're activating the solar plexus region. I want you to inhale, breathe into the stomach, feel balloon up, you should feel it touch the right thigh. And then exhale, as you exhale, try to draw in the belly button. like a little vacuum. Inhale. Big stomach. Exhale. Vacuum. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Woo! Talk about a low back massage. Inhale, left hand comes back to the, meet the right. And then exhale, switch sides. Right hand grabs the left ankle, gaze under the left armpit. Right back to it. Inhale, big stomach. Feel it press against the left inner thigh. Exhale, draw it in. Pull it in, it gives you a fun sensation. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Breathe deep. Exhale it all out. Right hand comes back as you inhale. And exhale, just pause, shake it out. Wonderful. Drop the knees down. Walk the hands forward, keeping the hips above the knees. Come into puppy pose. So while we're in puppy pose, for the sake of this one, 
I like to stay on my fingertips, but you can keep flat hands. But I just like to be on my fingertips just so you know. It gives you a little extra boost or lift. But right here, depending on where you're at with your puppy pose, it's all good. If you need a cushion on your chest, you can always like modify this pose. But we're gonna do active puppy pose. So on the inhale, you inhale, again, balloon the stomach up. The chest might drop deeper. And then as you exhale, I'm gonna suck in, pull in, and curl in slightly, knitting the front ribs together. So inhale, open up. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale, open up. Exhale, curl and squeeze. Three more, inhale. Exhaling. Breathing in, letting go of any flexion. And then curl as you breathe out. Last one, inhale. And breathing out. We're gonna hold it here. So as you inhale, keep the flexion. Exhale. Inhale, drop it back down, chest lowers down, open back up. And then exhale, we're just gonna roll forward, bring the hips down to the ground, come to Sphinx Pose. So here, elbows are underneath the shoulders, a little bit wider than our shoulders, pulling the elbows back to us to pull the chest forward, and then drop the head forward slightly. And we're just breathing here, this is our last pose. I love finishing with this because it reminds you of where your breath is. So right now, close your eyes, tap into where you're breathing. If you are breathing through your stomach, you will feel your body move while in this pose. So to bring more mindfulness to that, can you inhale, try to lift your whole body up with just your breath here. Exhale, feel your body drop back down. Inhale, big stomach. Exhale, drop it down. Last one, breathing in as much as you can. And breathing out. <laughs> oh, and this is where you just relax. <laughs> Or turn on over for a Shavasana. Either way, I respect you and I appreciate you and I uh, adore you for sharing your practice with me. And I truly mean that. Uh, my channel just hit 100,000 uh, subscribers recently. And the fact that over 100,000 of you are here rocking with me, it just. <laughs> I almost got in tears about the other day, but it seriously makes my heart warmer than you can ever imagine knowing that so many of you are going to be following with me in these videos and that like my personal practice, just my movement practice, me sharing it can impact others, help them live more pain free, help them get in their body better, help them feel better about their body, you know, more confident. There's so many things to it, right? But whatever that is for you, it doesn't matter. I appreciate you for being here and I appreciate you for showing up. And I hope this little connection to our solar plexus did, did, you, did you good today because I know I'm now warm. <laughs> I think the culture, Cold chill is gone. So yeah, I hope we both won out of this. So until next time, much love and namaste.